Hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can remove Bing search from your start menu, from your taskbar, as well as removing it from Microsoft Edge. Now, whether you want to remove Bing search because of a slow start menu, privacy concerns, or just choosing a different search engine, this video is going to show you exactly how to remove it. So you'll first need to head over to your start menu and we're just going to search for settings and then bring up the settings window. From the left hand side we need to come down to privacy and security and then scroll down once more and we need to come inside of search permissions. Now once again come down into this cloud content search section and you can see here it says Windows search can personalize your search results by including your content from OneDrive, SharePoint, Outlook and Bing and other services. So we're just going to go ahead and disable both these options by turning them off and then you'll need to scroll down to the bottom here and you'll also want to make sure that more settings and show search highlights is turned off and then we can come over to Windows privacy options. Once again, you need to make sure all of the options inside of here are turned off and disabled. Feel free to read through these to see exactly what each of these do. Otherwise, just go ahead and make sure all of these are set to off and then we can close out of this window. So just by following those steps alone, that will have now disabled Bing search from the start bar here, as well as disabling Bing from the taskbar at the bottom down here. Now we're going to go ahead and disable Bing also from Microsoft Edge. And to do that, you'll just need to go ahead and launch up Microsoft Edge and then come over to the three dots in the top right here and come over to settings. From the left hand side, we need to select privacy, search and services, come all the way down down to the bottom here and select address bar and search. Now currently you can see the search engine that is being used by Edge is Bing. Now obviously we want to change this so go ahead and just select the drop down and you can change this to whatever you desire. I'm going to go ahead and select Google. Then next you'll have this option down here for search on new tabs uses search box or address bar. Now at the moment this is set to search box which is essentially Bing. So we're going to go ahead and change this to address bar. And once we've done that, we can then come over to this tab in the left where it says start home and new tabs. So what we're going to do is just change all of the options down here. So when Edge first launches up on your computer, at the moment it will load Bing. We're going to change this so it now opens Google. So all you need to do is select open these pages down here, click on add a new page and then type in google.com and hit add. And now we're going to come down to this home button here and this is really optional. If I toggle this on, you can see we have the home button over here. And now at the moment, this will just take us to Bing. So what we're going to do is we're going to set this to also google.com. And now you'll need to restart your browser in order for these changes to take effect. And if I launch back up Microsoft Edge, you can now see that google.com first launches when I start up the browser. And if I press the home button over here, you can see this also takes me to Google. So the very last thing you'll need to do to remove all instances of Bing from appearing on your computer is we're just going to change some edits to the registry. So just close out of Microsoft Edge and we're going to come over to our start menu and just search for registry editor. And then you'll need to right click on this and run this as administrator. So before we make any changes to the registry editor, I'd always recommend creating a backup just by coming over to file and selecting export. And then you can give your backup file a name. I'm just going to call it backup and hit save. And that way, if we ever do need to restore the backup, we can just come over to file and select import and then locate your backup file. So to fully remove Bing search, what we need to do is come down to H key local machine and expand this inside of software. Scroll all the way down to find a folder called policies and expand this down here. And then we need to come down to this Microsoft folder and expand this. And we're looking for a folder inside of here called edge. Now, if you don't have a folder inside of here called Edge like I don't, then what you need to do is just right click on Microsoft over here, come over to new and select key, and then just give this the name of Edge and hit enter. Now we're just going to left click on this Edge folder to make sure we're inside of this, and then you need to right click somewhere on this white space over here, click on new and select D word 32 bit value. Then you'll need to go ahead and give this the name of hubs sidebar enabled and hit enter. And then we're just going to double click on this file and give it the value data of zero and hit OK. Then we can close out of the registry editor. And the last thing you'll need to do is head back over to Microsoft Edge. In the URL bar, we just need to type in edge colon forward slash forward slash policy and hit enter. And then you'll need to go ahead and select reload policies. And this will have now removed any instances from Bing appearing on your computer. And it's as simple as that, guys. If this video did help you, then please consider dropping a like and subscribing. And I'll see you in the next one.